Hi, I'm Andreas and I would like to give you a few tips how to get off the grid. Do you want to be less dependent on international corporations, stock markets, governments or the infrastructure in your area? No need to shut yourself away, neither individually nor in a community. There are a few things that you can do to make life less stressful and that make you more resilient in times of economic or climate crisis. Of course, producing your own energy is a good start. You can use solar energy and wind energy for for this. Although in initial investments to be able to produce your own electricity might be high in some cases, there are some low cost due to self alternatives that are available. For example, you can build your own solar panels or parabolic dishes you can use solar energy also in other ways, for example, for heating water or cooking. Also, producing your own food can be very useful. You might think this requires a lot of work, but there are some technologies available that reduce required work dramatically once they are set up. For example, you can build an aquaponics system, system that might require even less work cybernated farm systems are cur currently under development. Maybe you would like to build your own chicken coop. There are also instructions and plans available for many other useful things, for example storage sheds or wind generators. If you study earthships, you will find many more ideas how you can get off the grid without giving up any amenities. They include concepts for low energy air conditioning, water cycles and much more. The combination of architecture and ecology that is used for earthships can also be used at a much, much larger scale. A long term goal of solar panels brisbane.info is to initiate cooperatives that run such ecology systems, system that, systems that provide a lot of free amenities once they are set up. Thanks for watching this and please find more information on solarpanelsbrisbane.info.